Good morning guys, it's Sunday. I'm kickstarting the day by cleaning the windows in the rain. <laughs> Fancy life, but it has to be done because it was raining yesterday as well. So the windows are really dirty and I can't, I just can't live with that. I've even done sparkling eyes today looking fancy so let's get this done with i am currently taking some pictures and making some instagram stories of some of the vintage pieces then they're going to be up on the story and on instagram so that if any of you would like to purchase some of it you can do that from there so um this is um a beautiful very retro dress and i've also just been taking some pictures of this beautiful sweater and this one with pom-poms on it Here's an update. What is it? Half past ten? I think it's about half past. The sign has died. Boom! It is half past ten o'clock and there is nobody here. So we have just been laughing. Yeah. Looking around, like yeah. Pictures. Yeah, there is nothing telling really. Each telling each other how ugly we are. <laughs> yeah. so. I, love each other. I was taking pictures of Julianne and then I just started singing, You're so vain. <laughs> you probably think this. It was fun. You should have been there. Mm. But I don't know if we should do a question and answer thing in this video. We could put something out on Instagram, then we have something to do. And something to tell you about that. Because my life is so interesting. <laughs> yeah, lots. Yes. We need someone to come around. Mm. I thought you had some friends, but no, she don't. <laughs> <laughs> and it's just raining so freaking bad today. Mm. So on top of the fact that it's Christmas lunch, weekend and mm. it's close to christmas it's all just pissing down yeah. nobody wants to come out here no. everyone who came yesterday they were like so wet soaking wet from like driving here so i just understand i guess i understand yeah and people have hangovers and yeah sick yeah but at my job in the city there's always like dead silence until like 12 o'clock yeah, on Sundays. Yeah, on Sundays. It's crazy. So, we cross the fingers that somebody's gonna come and show up. Yes, we will. By the way, we're too short. We are, by the way, aunt one and two. One and two. And one and two. <laughs> one and two. <laughs> so. And we're gonna see the baby today. Yeah, I'm so excited to see him. Yeah. I'm just sad that he's not a ginger. I was hoping he would <laughs> be a ginger. Part, so he would be, become a ginger. With those jeans. No, not jeans? really. Jeans? Jeans? It would have been cold. It hurt. Uh, it, it's, I tried to say, you know, like genetic jeans, mm. but it sounded like Pat's jeans. Ah. Yeah. So. Yeah. Stupid me. <sighs> it's four o'clock <laughs> and um, we're closing down. It's been an eventful 24 hours, both with the whole petite situation, but also becoming aunts. Uh, Andreas was by here a couple of hours ago to buy two um, bamboo toothbrushes for himself and for Matilda because they apparently didn't bring any to the hospital. And um, the hospital is right over here, so he could just like walk here and walk back again. It was super nice to see him. Um, he didn't look different <laughs> being a dad. He looked like himself, but just tired. Just tired. It's been a really good day, and uh, I got a few flowers that I should show you. I got this beautiful bouquet from two of Julianne's friends. Actually, they dropped by with that one. So beautiful. I got this from my um, aunt yesterday. If I haven't showed you, and then Julianne's friends also bought me some. Christmassy bits to put in my boutique This one I got yesterday from a friend and then I got this one from my bosses in the thrift shop Actually, they dropped by to say Congratulations, and I got this one and then I also got This one from my friend today and this one from some 
friends of the family yesterday so it's overall been good and people have been really nice complimenting everything so are we ready to go home yeah we're both exhausted and hungry and hangry i'm not hungry anymore because i've eaten so many cabinets. yeah but yeah me but too I'm just tired yeah me too a long time yeah we need that I need some food and I was thinking that I should have some soup okay. Ooh. guess I'm gonna try that maybe put in some extra spices if it doesn't really taste like anything I almost dropped this on my feet I've also just put some clothes to get washed in the basement because it's about time. I don't think I've washed anything for two weeks and I'm like out of undies, so it is about time. But it's been a really, really nice weekend. I've had so much fun in the boutique. I've had so much fun with having people that I know dropping by, people that I don't know dropping by. It's just been fun. I know that it is maybe the most difficult time of the year that I've decided to open a boutique also in the location that I have because one thing is that everyone are at Christmas dinners or buying Christmas presents in the stores the known stores but another thing is that my boutique is not placed in the city center so you have to get people to actually take their bikes or their cars a bit outside the city like we're only talking one kilometer outside the city center center but it's just been raining it's been raining non-stop yesterday and today and now it's even a storm like it's so windy it even like took and pushed selena a bit when we drove back home so it's really not the weather to get people to come outside the city center so um it's just been a bit of a struggle people busy people don't really want to go that far so yeah, I'm just grateful for those who did um, drop by and yeah, I'm excited to have my everyday life down there to like take my computer down there and just sit and chill, open the boutique, have people coming in for a chat. Yeah, but for now I just need some food so I'm gonna make some food and I also have so much cleaning to get done. I, I mean, I have no clean clothes. My living room looks like a complete mess. So we, tomorrow is gonna be cleaning day. <laughs> we're gonna have to wait with that chat because it's not today and we're gonna chill now. I need that. Hey guys, it's a quarter past nine and I have been sleeping. I've actually been sleeping for one and a half hours at least. Just went down to the basement and then my scalp is kind of dry so it started to irritate me. So I just thought I would grab my <laughs> my scalp cure from Australian Body Care. And then I also realized that today is actually the end of the Advent giveaway with Australian Body Care. So I need to find a winner <laughs> from the video before I go to bed. So I'm just going to put some of this, not into my nose, but onto my scalp. So that it's going to give a bit of moisture and cool down a bit. Ugh. I feel like just scratching it because it's so dry. Everything is dry at the minute, like my skin, my nails, my fingers. So it would be good. I'm going to do that. And then we should also open. Some of you might be wondering if I've seen my brother's kit yet. I unfortunately haven't. Um, I hope that we are going to go see him tomorrow, like Juliana and I. Because my mom went over there today after work. But that was while Juliana and I, we were still working in the basement. So um, I hope that tomorrow is going to be the day that we get to see him. This is um, nice hair. This is just so nice to sit like this and like pull it through. Oh, it's just lovely. I think what also makes it feel so nice is that you can rub this a little bit 
on your scalp while you push some of the cream out so it just has the nicest calming feeling but yeah i'm just gonna go get oh i thought that was gonna happen sorry number 15 oh what is this it's a white musk flora oil de toilette that's a perfume, isn't it? I'm not super fancy. I know nothing about perfumes or anything. Julianne and I, by the way, did not manage to film a Q&A today because luckily there were suddenly people in the boutique. We had just been waiting for some time. Mm, has such a natural rose mm, kind of smell. I really like this one, actually looks like this white mask that goes directly into my collection that's a really nice present i really like that one because it's something i never managed to get for myself like perfumes so that's a good one oh has not that such a nice smell it's very gentle it's good and then number 15 please let it be christmas tree it is another Christmas tree. We are now just three Christmas trees away from one million. But I think that happens to my sister pretty much every single year. So um, we might still just win 25 Danish corner or we might still just win zero. <laughs> Those were my calendars. And I still have some clothes in the basement getting dried. Tomorrow is going to be very much of a getting my apartment sorted kind of day. I'm also going to pick up two packages in my PO box from some of you guys. Or maybe letters, but there is something in my PO box that I'm going to go pick up. My PO box is, by the way, going to close next year. So I'll change the address under my videos to the address on the boutique. So if you ever want to send me a little something, it's going to be to that address instead of to the P.O. box. Because from now on, Post North wants you to pay a fee on like 30 euros, 35 dollars ish every month if you want to have a P.O. box. Which I can't afford. Can't afford. So um, yeah, but I'm going to end the vlog here. I hope that you enjoyed it. I've had such a nice opening weekend. It's just been really cozy. It's been nice to seeing people. It's very obvious that it's a busy weekend that I've chosen and that it's very close to Christmas. People are busy. So there hasn't been like many people around. But it's just been nice and chill. And I've kind of just liked spending time down there just all cozy. So I hope that you enjoyed this vlog. Leave a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Thank you so much. For your love and support on my videos and in everything I do. It means the world. Like seriously I mean that. So um, yeah. I'm going to see you all again tomorrow. Good night. Bye guys.